So again, <laughs> uh, you're the decider. Are you going to ask Rebazar how to live your life? Is that what you're going to keep doing? Or are you going to decide? It doesn't matter. Because they're not going to tell you how to live your life and what to do, etc. They're going to show you things uh, and you make the choice, just like in Jeremy's experience. You know, you make the moves. You can ask all you want. Though that's the old ideas of ask the master to tell you what to do. Just like when you live with your parents, you ask your parents. But now it's you deciding, you see? And you'll notice that the answers that you get, um, you don't always want that answer, do you? Okay. So it's very interesting how the personal self, that all comes from the personal self. Does the sun ask anything? All life is an isness. And the sun decides to shine. It doesn't ask anything. So as you keep asking, actually, many times you will confuse yourself more. It just depends because of how the answers come about. They're not going to basically come about how your personal self wants them. So in other words, you ask them, well, where should I live? Where is the best place for me to live? Well, sometimes they will tell you a good place to live. You know, uh, they could say, well, you know, best place to live right now for you is China. And so uh, Hong Kong, China, if they say that, will you go? Will you do it? You asked, are you ready for the answer? Are you ready to follow through? So, again, probably not. And so you'll just kind of let it go. See, as you keep asking, you're not really deciding. You're already doing it. You are the decider. Yeah. So the answer that you got, that's your answer. But again, is that the answer you want? Are you looking for the answer you want? Usually the personal self is. For, for the most part, people want a happy answer. You know, it's kind of like when you go to a psychic. You know, do you see me being rich in the future? A, a person will ask the psychic. And the psychic can say, yes, I see you. You're going to be very rich. But what the psychic usually doesn't tell the person is, is that you got to go out and get a job and earn it. Okay. It's not going to just come to you. You got to figure it out. So again, you ask the question. You got whatever you got. Okay. So you decide if that's the answer you want to agree with, or do you want to decide? You see? Because that's the answer they gave you. It's interesting, isn't it? Again, the past doesn't work. All that works is what is new now, every moment. And you are the decider. That's how it is. That's it. So people can ask questions all day long, but they still have to decide. And is that what they want to decide with the answer that they got? Well, it's always that simple. See, it's so simple that we question it. It's the sun shining. That's all. I mean, that's all. More than everything. But uh, until we, uh, you know, really decide to accept it, we keep going through all these things. It's really letting go to where you don't consider anything. And see, uh, that's a two-sided position, okay? Because you have creation and you have uh, the isness life is, that's awareness. You have these two positions because you still have bodies here, okay? so. Uh, but again, you answered your own question. It's very, very simple. And again, yes, it's not about right or wrong. Right or wrong is just something made up. Everything in creation is made up. You are the decider when it comes to your so-called marriage and divorce. You see, um, that's kind of the scam here. You get married, then you get divorced. Or you live with someone a long time and you 
uh, you know, just become old and go into more lifetimes, whatever. Okay, we've done it so many times. But again, you you decided no matter what was showing to you, and it can be shown that, yes, it would be a good thing for you to get divorced. You're, you're looking for a confirmation to feel confident. That's understandable because that's the personal self, because at times it doesn't know and it needs help. That's the personal self. And we all need advice or just like driving down the road and all of a sudden we're lost. So we stop and ask somebody, you know, which way do I go to get to get there? And so, yes, it's like that. That's the personal self. The real you, again, is recognition. You recognize, all right, uh, that's recognition. And that's a choice also. You decide to recognize what is real, or you decide to just keep making choices in creation. You're the decider, yeah. Yeah, and, you know, you can use the ideas of right and wrong sometimes, or, or better and worse, or whatever. At times, you will use these ideas. Or belief, oh, I believe in this, or I believe in that, or I don't believe that can happen, or whatever. You will use those phrases, yeah. But it's not something set in us anymore. It's not something solid in us anymore. These are just little funny uh, ideas that we kind of utilize to communicate with others and ourselves at times, because we talk to ourselves. We need to. And just like you have the little hand puppets, you need to talk to them sometimes, and they're going to tell you certain things. Yeah. So it's a very interesting journey. And uh, again, as the sun is shining, there's no end. So there's really no rush, is it, to get to the point of, oh, you know, I just want to be aware of everything, all, all life, everything. There's no such thing. Okay? Because it's an idea. When you just let go of everything, like the birds, they don't consider anything. You just be now and just do what you do. See? You just be <laughs> now and do what you do. See, we have so much mind stuff going that it confuses us. You have societies, you have cultures, you have traditions, you have history, all these things. Just a lot of confusion. So see them as references of something you don't need, but they are references it can be utilized. You really don't need a car because you can really fly. Uh, but then again, until you can fly, you use your car. So, but there will come a time when you won't need the car anymore. So you just have to be patient. Yeah, it's that patient. Stop pushing. Stop pushing for the answers with to all life because there's no such thing. Even though we use that reference, it's in the literal sense. And see, again, this is where the Ekas, they're all confused because it's all literal. They, they, can't, they can't see past that, and their master won't let them see past their literal self. And so here, I keep pointing to people, what is unseen? What is invisible? I just wrote a group, invisible seeing. That's really what it is and learn to relate to your personal self accordingly and not always letting your personal self decide how you're going to see what's real. There's a difference. See, there are a lot of decisions that need to be made to figure it out. So, yes, we have real side experiences, but the experience in the real side, which is just right here now, just like now, you, you really don't need any of them. But for the personal self, because of what we're dealing with in the world, it's very helpful. See? But, but actually, at some point in your life, you won't need any of it. You won't even be interested. Because you'll be okay. You'll just be aware. And so, is it that we really need to be aware of something that we're not aware of? Is it really that important? Hmm. Or is it just okay that we just be now and we just do what we do? And everything we need will show up because that's how life is. So we don't have to question it, do we? 
and confuse ourselves. You know, the questions confuse yourself. When you stop asking questions, guess what? You're no longer confused. See? Remember when we were confused? See? We talked about that a long time ago. We're doing better now, aren't we? <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. We went over that a whole lot. Yeah. 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 Just make it yeah. fun. Just make it fun. That's all. Just make it fun. Oh, and it, it doesn't matter. So you may as well make it fun. Yeah. Yeah. It's not serious. <laughs> Not serious. You're not looking for your next initiation because there's no such thing, you know. But some people think there is, and they can do that. But no such thing. You don't need it. Actually, it's better that you don't have it. We've already went through that. 